Hey now, Micah, here's another style that's super easy. Oh, I'm popular now. George, he's at dinner with the family and friends. Yeah? Micah, this is another style of playing the open tuning. Same guitar, thumb pick, as the last video. And same tuning, open D. Now, to make a tune with this technique, this style, it's always a strum, you know, at first. What you're gonna use is the fifth fret, and then down to the third fret, and then off. So it'll be like this. You can't mute. You see that muting like that? That's how I play harmonica. This is I should have a harmonica in my mouth right now, but no big deal. Mute it. Fifth fret. Open fifth fret. Third fret. Open. I still got mush brain from COVID, so I'm having trouble talking still after three. I don't know, almost four months now I've had it. I just got side effects now, but whatever. So it's really like, you're strum, you know? Then mute it. Fifth fret. Third fret. finger that you can put over most of the strings to get that sound. It's called barring. It's kind of like the same thing as using a slide. You're doing the same thing with your finger. You know, you're kind of putting it over the fret like that. See what I mean? There's the fifth fret, and there's the third fret, and then off. So what you're doing is you're just pressing down on a bunch of strings. Not all of them, because you can't get all of them. So it's really like the top three strings. And that mute is very important because you can make the strings under your fingers ring out. See what I mean? Or you can stop it completely. There you go. So there's another tune for you. It's another technique. It's really meant for playing harp. But I got a feeling this isn't the right harmonic that's in my rack, so I can't just put it on and show you. Oh, no way. Totally the wrong harmonica for this tuning. Come on, darling, get over there now. Thank you. So remember the strum always. Fifth fret. Third fret. That's it. There's a lot more to it, but that's the gist of it. You like that word, the gist? That's an American word, I guarantee it. In the Philippines. I don't know, I never heard nobody say it from the Philippines before. If you get the gist of it, that means do you understand it, you know? If you can understand it. So the gist is a cool word. I like it a lot, actually. Gist. J-I-S-T, just. <laughs> yeah, that's it. Ciao, baby. Merry Christmas.